Hey, we're back at it again. I just dropped a car off at this body shop. It's a little this Honda Odyssey up here. Uh, but I was talking to the gentleman that owns this body shop, and he uh he got this car in right here. Unbelievable. Uh, anyway, those those two uh, those two young girls in this car, and uh, somebody was uh, being chased by the police, and they ran a red light and hit this uh, hit these two girls. Uh, one of them did survive, the, uh, the other one didn't. But this is the kind of thing that happens out here on, on the roads, and uh, people people running from the cops. Man, you can't run from the police. You got to pull over. This is what happens. You kill people. Uh, but this is a tragedy, man. But uh, it's terrible, man. Anyway, I put these wrecks, these wrecks on here, because uh, I think it's important for people to see uh, what, what what can happen if you're on the road. You know, be aware when you're driving. You've got to be aware uh, of what's going on around you. Uh, there's always that insinuating circumstance that uh, you pull out and somebody's running a red light or somebody's running from the cops or whatever happened. This can happen easy. It can happen to anybody. So yeah, I encourage anybody out there, man, drive safe, man. Stay off the phone. Drive safe. Looks like we got a pretty rough one here. Uh, we just left that body shop. And uh, we got some impounds. Got, some, got an impound call. Whoever owns this car, uh, they peel the sticker off. I guess they feel like that they, they're gonna be able to keep this car uh, on property. Sometimes people get uh, this misconception uh, that it don't matter what, what condition their car gets in, uh, but this car's gotta go. It's got flat tires, expired tag, front end is falling off of it, and it's been here for, over, I think the lady said it's been here for a year. So it's gotta go. We're fixing to load this one up. go that's pretty common they got it backed up on the bushes that's real uh, it's real common they back it up on the bushes where you can't check the tag this is the kind of crap they pull anyway yeah, 20 2018 he's fixing to get yanked <sighs> There he is.
You better call the office, man. Say what? So you got a 2018 tag, bro. You got to call the office. You can't back it up on the bush. You expect the tow guy not to get it. Well, you fixing to leave with it right now? Uh, you, you gonna have to. You gotta go. You gotta leave the property with it, huh? You can't do that, huh? Well, why'd you pull it out of the parking place? If you're not leaving, why did you try to drive it off? This is what I do. I tow cars. Drive up to the office up there, and go inside and talk to the girls in the office. And maybe they'll let you keep it here. Because it's not up to me. It's up to the office. The office is, yeah. yeah, talk to the ladies. They're yeah. They're the reason it was stickered. It's not me, it's them. Just talk to the manager. She might let you have time. All right, have a good one. This ain't nothing but a shell. falling off the truck we're gonna roll to the yard and get out of here sign this other one out anyway uh now that gentleman with the black maxima is driving his car around if he don't come up here to the office and talk to the office and get permission to be here i'm gonna find that car he's got it he, he if he's not at the office then that means he went to hide hide the car on the property I can tell you this right here, if he didn't uh if he didn't get it straightened out and he's hiding, then I like playing hide and seek. I will find his car. And it will get yanked if it's on this property. Uh, a lot of times people they like to they like to play games. Here we go. Looks like we got one. It's a no tagger. We got a no tagger. It's gonna have to get loaded. We're gonna go ahead and get a quick, quick hook on it. I can't always take my, take my time and do a, uh oh. Here we go. Here they come. Come around this side over here. Come on, come on this side. Um, we just wanted to know where you're gonna take it. Yeah, I'll give you the address. All right, you, you got the option to pay it out if you wanna pay it out. The, 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 that's up to you. I got to give you that option. Uh, by law, I have to give you the option to pay it out. It's a hundred bucks if you want to pay it out. If not, you can come get it later. Okay. Yeah, we just wanted to know where you're gonna take it. Okay. All right. Because my dad's not here. It's not here. I got you. I got you. Yeah, it's going to that address. Mm -hmm. I'll tell him the quicker he comes and gets it, the better off he'll be. Okay. Uh, the, the, the longer you wait, the more it is. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Thank you sir. But I did give give them the option to pay it out. A lot of people don't don't give the, uh, the vehicle owners that option. It's plain and simple. If somebody comes out, you got to offer them, and you're hooked to it. 
got to offer them to let them pay it out on property and remove it from the property if it runs. That's the way it works. So I, I do it strictly by the book. This car here was stickered too. Stickered right there. It's got a 820. It's got an August 20 tag. He breaks up. I'm gonna back up and hook this one. It's got expired tag, but I gotta watch out for these kids. I'm gonna have to let the kids get out of the way before I start trying to load it. I do a lockout now. Anyway, uh, we're gonna go ahead and pull these off right out here and sign them out and get them out of here. That's just how it goes. Load up and roll.